here. Very much so now for the side of NRG as Divine does get domed. Thrash gonna be committed and everything, and now it's just gonna be the full shift. Nearby, though, is Jing. Showstopper at the ready. Looking to catch one. Does find him. Spike now gonna be dropped out onto the ground. Showstopper. And he's saying, you've got no time to work with. Sends out the Showstopper. Crash, he's gonna be dead. Cleans up Finesse. Oh! The victory is in the hands of Jing. A 4K to tie it up at 3-3. Three to three. In, By all of our expectations, you know, something was doing so much for this team. There we go. A bit of an aggressive play on the Eco round here for the RX. They try and clear through, but they have just been very clean. Turned to mince meat, haven't they? But uh, yeah, all expectations, you know, just to finish the point that I started. Play initiator. You heard from the desk earlier a little bit of a breakdown of this player, and he is mostly a gecko main. Flash misses, I think, actually. I went towards the left instead of through the main choke. Still Paper X, not shying away from it. They want to try and play fast. The move on spots, and that's just through the smoke. Jing, can't be getting away with that, man. Get out of here. The showstopper, it's an easy one. Three kills in the round. That's unholy. What is he doing? So not really been playing fast in B main. I was spitting B main. Here's the showstopper, an exchange of all sorts of utility. Sure that will pull him if they choose to use it. To recall. Oh, well, okay. Just a start. Propped up. Divide takes the timing right around the side there with RB. Follow up with the rifle. Zest. Containing this deep push as well. Fights all over the place. Missing the shot. Forsaken. Smoke up. That's going to make CGRS and Jing ready for it. CGRS has really struggled in these anchor spots before, but Jing's been excellent with it. It's one thing to be aware, it's another thing to stop it. They know the hits coming through onto A. All that space was gathered. There it is with the flash! Re-swing from Jing! And it's up to Zest to try and extend the play. There's no chance in hell! Oh, interesting. Into the free shot. Do you really want to be taking this fight <laughs> into them? Of course you do. Paper X. Oh my goodness. This yeah, they don't back dangerous. away from any sort of challenge, do they, Josh? No, they don't, but now Jing is getting pinched. He's got to be worried about Hooker. You can soft, silent drop out from Hooker now. Haunt was timing ever so slightly. Reveals him still. Maintains his hold on to it. Tried to satchel it. Here we go. I4 gives them showers control. All the way through. Again, you see the orbital strike being used right through main. Satchel to avoid it. Damage is done though. Sets up Mind Freak. He's able to beam him through. Jing through the back of the site. And it's on top of it. On top of the truck. It's two kills. Jump spot. Wide swing. Wants to take the fight. Spike drop down. There's really no reason. Lose. They're in a disastrous spot. Last play, it's the last round for it. Thresh going forwards, barreling into it, right through short. There's a rocket exchange as well in the races, but I don't know what's going on. Quite taken though, Jinx still alive in it. Brings down the adversary, Seekers as well, just pushing them back, but they have lost that showers control. Can Zest do anything with it? For flat through cave. CGRS, there was somebody watching, and I believe that was RB for just a moment. There's a real chance for some timings to be taken. That was fight, swinging through, there was no flash to really set it up, Nightfall as well, scattered us across, Jing, can't hear any sound cues, just trying to buy time as well, create and hold the space, Zest out in the open, it's got to be called, Jing, fight close with the reload, One enemy remaining. and Mako seeks as well to win out his fights by swinging close to the site, but Lambo is so it's close so to close, them. yeah. It can't be off that, this surely. Is, it's either going to go incredibly or terribly well, for Paper Rex. Pay attention to Jing. Here's the alarm bot. Here's the stun. Misses to the side. It's running gun in action. Up close. Dash to disengage. Spike has been dropped. Flash in his face. Kang Kang could not dodge it in time. So the trap play, it pays off massively. Waiting for some sort of timing. Here's an alarm bot. Satchel Holding for the fault line. Jing seeking to delay with the satchels. It would have to be just an absolute miracle in terms of shots being landed. EDG still doubled up, hoping that somebody will walk into them. Here's a flash, jumping right up to the top, but again, yeah, not set up for it. So Jing, this over towards Tree. Yep. They're not worried, are they? But they're going up against the half bite. Stunts. Oh, yeah, no way! Oh. Jing, your movement is just impeccable. Such clean movement. Door opens up towards Sand. Fights there. The shot lands. Kang Kang, he's taking a little walk about. Casual jaunt into mid. Again, bizarre from EDG, having gone to play rub, but it's 3v3, three, three, three three, sorry. And EDG have gone for another exec into A, late round. So Smoky's using that smoke to cross into the site device, cross their placement. That is perfect. Finds the first one, Jing is up in the air, there's no shot, he gets a kill, man. 
to buy one away from the Seekers as well. So if he can find a kill, he can make this retake really powerful. He's going for it, the pit! Dropped in by Finesse, but Jing does catch him just fast enough. Picked it. And then Jing, let's go ahead and shove it back. Finds the second one, Jing. We'll trade it. The Killjoy is now going to be taken down, and that leaves Artisan a 1v1. The full flash comes in. Chang will scoop a third kill here. 23! Oh! oh. <laughs> well, the dream is dead, Michael. The comeback is on. Big one. Lovely. Now, let's see if they can keep it clean. Flash to follow. Boaster. A little bit of a challenge. Are they going to push on this one? OK, he should be dead. How is he alive? There we go. Spike now down. It's all looking rosy. Still, Leo does connect one, but a quick trade for Jin, and we're, we're all good here. That spike should never fall back into hand. Paper X, look, four standing. Coming in hot with that one. Um, for now, though, you can see the boy coming out. With stingers, bits and pieces. Um, but every round is, is incredibly dangerous for Paper X in a very real way. One rifle recovered. Oh, that paint shell. Very fortunately placed for Jing there. It's going to catch Alpha for any chance to close that gap, but the plot is in. So pressure now comes back on. Working though in, Paper X doing very well here, Durka, the only one to steal some damage. That's a rifle found, and he does take one more down with him. But the defuse is there. Acting not here to greet it, but how deep do Paper X force the issue here? And, and the quick response looks like it's from Durka anyway, and, and Fnatic taking that B site. Instantly to work, Chronicles isolated one very early on. Jing with a fantastic response! Claiming two, cutting them off of the knees on the way in towards that B site, Fnatic. Left down to Leo and Boaster. That heel towards Jing. He's been a superstar for him so far. Boaster gonna find one Jing on the trade. And now a 1v3. Boaster, this is a tall task for him. It's a horrible amount yeah. of players to work Look with. at the setup on the X ray as well. Mm. Even just the high low from mine freaking yeah, I mean, Jing's, Jing's, Jing's enough, yeah. So deep in the pit as well. Yeah. Good luck. Not gonna happen, Jing. All right. But no Molly one said the, save him I was yet. Saying, Molly under the window is gonna slow things down here. Oh, there's the savior! Alpha comes around, gets two just. So you can see Jing getting towards the side. Down to 2v2. Jing and Mind Freak up against Chronicle and Durka. Spike is down. They're yet to plant it. And Jing is desperate to try and hold on to this. Hold that close territory. 91 HP. And the first challenger emerges. Second! He's got him dead. Jing holding on for another round. Slow creep back around towards A. Once again, Chronicle and Alpha tested. First contact made. Jing lucky to be standing after that. An opportunity there. Passes. And the site now going to be flooded. Jing lovely work towards Chronicle. He's opened up a chance as Alpha slips a little deeper. Real position as the plant comes in, but the time is on Paper X's side. But this post plant, what do they have for it? You can see Alpha getting so close. Gets checked on. Fantastic work. Paper X finally stabilizing a little here. And Jing takes away Leo from this. Spike in his hand. So can I go for the wingman plant now? Can try to invest that one. The nano swarms are committed here from Artis. As the smokes dissipate. Flash set into the back. They're looking for the aggressive push. Jing gonna be able to find two. Artis and Finesse gonna be cleaned up. Victor on the opposite side. Takes out Mind Freak. Nade comes their way though for the delaying. This waterfall push coming in. Dubai looks to go aggressive. The turn into the corner. CGRS finding one, then taken down. It's an absolute bloodbath. The, the Odin investment, the operator investment. Heavy Maya, now they're seeking a clash and a skirmish now. This time trying to put the hurt on a team that has just been taking this space for free. Paper X, mean a match in one capacity. CGRS falling, but it is again evened out. Suspect shown even more, just right past the Viper wall. Jing is not afraid of it. Now here comes the showstopper, combined with the neural theft. Even one up in the air. Skipping right around the side, his position was popped out from the neural theft, the second pop of it. Jing is just so damn confident, this guy! Bit of counter spam may be in order, but no kills to be found, no damage either. The nanoswarms are already being cleared. It's the bait and switch, and they wait at the util. Here's a Sancho play. What is that? You can always count on Jing, and he has just broken apart the defense in the blink of an eye. Movement so clean, Jogamo seeking to deny. There's the plan, disrupted with two kills there, dodging off the showstopper. Nade at his feet, round to the corner, Jing. Will not let him get away with it. Onto the close corners in case somebody was hiding. They know the positioning of Mind Freak roughly. He gave it away with the paranoia about five seconds ago. 30 seconds left, Josh. They're going into B here, into the connector. Jing, he hasn't been dealt with. Still has an aid and a satchel. Jing, he's pushing forwards into them. He's taking a second kill away from Satchel still there. Nade on top, 20 seconds remaining. It has to be a quick pivot, but right into the arms. And sightline of Mind Freak. Blinded up, does not matter.
Still has the shots. Spike dropped behind the wall. Time running short. Still only 12 seconds. Jorgamo, he cleans him up. He's carving out a path. Maybe onto the site themselves. Come, he needs to get this plan down with only five seconds left. Blood down, stunned out. Come has to stick in a rocket wall close. Jing is a monster. Similar scenes to the beginning of the round that we've just seen, only this time to pull. Double satchel play. Jing's already in their face. Trailblazer on the back. Stunned up. Where's the punish? Satchel making a mark. No way. Jogamo was hoping to punish that. He's brought down anyway. Here we go. Look, timings. Be careful, gonna be certain of this one. Could not adjust it with a spray down, so come only grabbing the one, but eventually brought down. Players enough and a bound. This is brought to a two versus two. Big timing from Bustio there. And he's watching for Jing. Oh, Jing still wins it. Here's an attempt from DRX. They do take that lamps control. There's a pull. It's really mistimed a little bit. An attempt to reclear into showers. Over the strike, pushes Buzz really far back into it. Lined up. Zest lands that one shot with the sheriff. Rocket up in the air, Jing. Oh my goodness. He's an easy target. The rifles sail them away. Star and he used it to smoke heaven, so he doesn't have a pull on the plant right now. Silent drops down, makes a bit of noise here. Cosmic divide cuts through into the site. Now you start to see it. DRX moving forwards. High ground position. Forsaken still holding it. He's got the dash back and enabled. Brought down though, but the trades are online for them and it's left just down to Mako. Lovely movement. But yeah, and part of the reason why they're so successful is because they opt into these forces all the way through. Stingers into the back of it. This time Jorgamon will meet them. Play through, catching onto the heels of Kwame, seeking to reposition, vulnerable to up, enough damage done, but the bullets spraying around Cove in his face, he can't get the weapon out in time. It's just punishments all over the place. Dissipation of the smoke. Grants an easy sight line. Ult's already built up, why not expend it? Round two, by the way, round two. And still hunting him down with a rifle, but blind as a bat, Demon One cannot stand his ground. Oh, what a response! And that's Paper X to a T, the force up attack side. Utilizing the plant money and the fact that they got quite a few kills in round one.